The area of land currently known as Lake Claremont has not always been the beautiful area it is today. In its history it has been utilised as market gardens, a garbage dump, a golf course. But in 2009 the golf course was closed, giving the Friends of Lake Claremont organisation a great opportunity to rehabilitate one of the last remaining wetlands in Perth. Heidi Hardesty has spent five years on the board of the Friends of Lake Claremont, helping the organisation earn 11 state grants worth $288,000. She is in charge of the rehabilitation project for the lake, which is the largest bushland rehabilitation project undertaken this winter. What projects is the organisation currently undertaking? We're in the middle of a massive vegetation project of Lake Claremont and the surrounding bushland. Since the Long Line Golf Course closed in 2009, it's opened up a huge opportunity to create over 10 hectares of native woodland to tie in with our existing bushland. We're currently revegetating three separate areas. The wetland bed itself, the wetland buffer, which is the fringing vegetation on the edge of the lake, as well as the remnant bushland and the adjacent old fairway. Been living here about three years, sort of only discovered the lake about two years ago, sort of got dragged down here by a friend and uh, it's actually a really beautiful spot, you know, you come down here, sort of clear your head, you know, get away from everybody, get away from the hustle bustle of the main Claremont area. And yeah, there's actually been uh, a lot of improvement around the lake recently, a lot of new plants getting put in, you know, areas getting brought back for that were, you know, previously sort of eroding away. And you know, a lot more animals sort of appearing around the lake and it's generally good times. Volunteer work is a crucial component to the rehabilitation of the lake. And recently, local schools have started the system. How important do you think the lake is for future generations? It's extremely important for future generations. We have very few remaining wetlands left and they provide a lot of ecosystem services. Wetlands themselves help prevent flooding, they purify our groundwater, they create habitat for wildlife, they create a beautiful park where people can exercise and relax and enjoy nature. How many seedlings have been planted this year? We planted 83,000 native seedlings, probably the largest project in all of Perth this winter. Yes, a lovely scene here, and one that's only going to continue to become more and more beautiful as summer hits us and the utilisation of Claremont Lake increases. Ten hectares of uh, land has been rehabilitated here, and local schools are starting to assist in the rehabilitation of Lake Claremont with the Society of Friends of Lake Claremont.